you know today we're going to talk a little bit about that most wanted campaign level playthrough that we saw in call of duty yesterday during gamescon and i wanted to talk a little bit about it because unless i wasn't paying attention or i wasn't sure it looks like one of the playable characters we're going to have his name is case for some reason i thought we would be playing as a different character but we're playing with william case cauldron and that's probably going to be the main character or the guy that we're playing with throughout the whole game kind of like we did with bell but the thing is that he might not talk again and i noticed that in the trailer because he didn't say a damn word or not even a the trailer but during the campaign uh showcase he didn't say a single word but it would be in line with what call of duty black ops has been doing especially with bell and you know other protagonists that they've had in the past now the mission starts in washington dc in 1991 and it looks like we're infiltrating an event that's going on like where you get to meet the president or meeting the future it says uh governor bill clinton okay so he's not even the president yet he's the governor but you're able to actually see bill clinton here to the left when we're taking a picture i thought that was a cool little detail and i know people are already gonna mod the hell out of that and probably extract him out and put him in multiplayer or whatever and to be honest we also get to see a little bit of how the gameplay is gonna go for call of duty black ops 6 and i did end up remembering that some of these missions are going to be open combat missions and it's like redefined completely built from the ground up and it's gonna like actually make sense unlike modern warfare 3s but i completely forgot about that and i'm kind of curious to see how big the levels are going to be how much free reign we're going to get what kind of things we're going to be able to do and i'm sure that a lot of these missions that we're seeing we're going to be able to tackle them in different ways like the mission here for most wanted i bet there's a couple different ways that we could tackle it another thing that i noticed here it looks like pantheon which are apparently going to be the main villains or the main faction that we're gonna have to be fighting is behind an attack during this event and it already looks like maybe the cia or the u.s government had russell adler caught like they had caught him and they were questioning him it looks like he's in an interrogation room some stuff is going on here but it looks like pantheon were aware that adler was here and so they came in to try to infiltrate and maybe take adler for himself it seems like adler knows some stuff that is extremely important to what's going on or maybe some secrets that they're trying to take from him. Another thing that we get to see here in the campaign trailer is a fight with a juggernaut and he looks extremely massive and difficult to kill but they were able to use an rc car to kill him almost instantly which i thought was very cool we also get to see the wheel uh the, of our choices and it looks like we get to carry about eight items which is neat and it kind of reminds me of like a gta you know when you're able to go through the wheel and change different weapons so it looks like you're gonna be able to carry a lot of different things when you're playing the campaign we were also able to see during this more gameplay combat and we were able to see a lot of the omni move actually in action during the campaign to be quite honest the sliding to the left and sliding to the right and kind of sliding backwards it looks a, it looks a bit unrealistic and i don't know how to feel about that yet i'm sure it's gonna be fun when i play it you know when you're able to dive backwards that's pretty cool able to dive to the side and to the right and to the front that's also pretty cool we got a little bit more of that in the trailer and it was able to be displayed but there was a lot of cool stuff in the campaign i also think i might have gotten a glimpse of the logo that pantheon is using and i want to know a little bit more about them so we might dig in a bit more to see what we can find but this campaign trailer was pretty damn cool and this was just like a chill laid back talk of some stuff that i liked and stuff that i saw what did you see and what did you like during this campaign reveal mm -hmm.